Hello everyone, this is Whack, yeah, Whack fucking Comics, and today I'm going to be unboxing my first ever CGC unboxing. So, I already did the one with Invincible number one, but that one came back way faster because it was, like, expensive, I guess. But this is a 20 book submission that I just got back, so I'm going to unbox it. I do know the grades, so, yeah, I couldn't, no, wait, how do people win it's also heavy as fuck. I feel like no one ever says how heavy a big submission is. That's fucking heavy. And I should have done this beforehand, but I always feel like people think you do something weird to the books or something if you don't uh, open it on screen. And I technically just didn't open it on screen, so good job, Tyler. There is a big ass hole in my fucking box too, but they're pa it's packed like fucking perfect. So here's uh my books and some cardboard. Make sure to show that off. So I sent these in with intentions of selling a hand at least a handful of these. And I'm still going to, but I'm not sure if I'm going to sell as many as I thought I was initially. All right, so here's the first one. Which side is it on? This side. This is Something's Killing the Children number two, Black Cape exclusive, and 9.8. I knew this was a 9.8. I should say what I thought it was going to be beforehand, but I definitely knew this was going to be a 9.8. It was perfect. I didn't get it pressed or cleaned. And that is a really cool cover that I was... This is one I was going to sell. Am going to sell. Will sell. I don't know. It's going to happen, though, probably. So there's one. Next one. A trend. Something is killing the children. Number one. Second print, I believe. 9.8. Also did not get this presser cleaned. I knew this was a 9.8. That's why I didn't say anything after I just said I was going to start saying stuff. Awesome cover. Not my favorite. But still a cool cover. Alright, let's start uh, pretending like I've done this before even though I haven't. Uh, this one... Spider-Man, the web of Spider-Man. I was pretty sure this should be like a 9.4-ish. It's not perfect, but it's solid. So I sent it in, and 9.0. Uh, I don't know why this is a 9.0. The back looks so good. The front... Also looks really good. Corners look good. Uh, it is off-white to white pages, but I have a 9.0 off-white to white pages. So it's not because of the page quality. Honestly, this looks very good. The corners look great. It looks really flat. I don't know. Maybe something's going on in, inside, but uh, I, I still thought it was going to be about a 9.4 because it, it just... Uh, the, the pages were... Just not quite as flat as I could get them, and it didn't look like it was pressable. 9.0, whatever. I'm selling that one, by the way. And Kanto, number one, first print. I got this pressed and cleaned, and I 100% thought this was going to be a 9.8. 9.8. This is going to... Uh, friend of mine named Austin LeMay. <sighs> I can't even believe what I'm trading this for, but I'm beyond fucking excited. So when this hit a 9.8, I was super excited because I knew I wasn't keeping it. You'll see that in a future video, I'm sure. Another one. Something is killing the children. Oh my god. Uh, so this is the book that I picked up off the shelf. I thought, uh, th it was the last one on the shelf 
And I flipped it over, and there's a big, like, color-breaking bend in it. So I'm like, well, you know, that's okay. This is the last one I can get. And uh, this is the copy I read five times, I believe. Maybe six times. But it got me to fall in love with the series. I fucking love this cover so much. This was a keeper for me all day. I knew it was probably going to be roughly a 9694. I did get it pressed and clean, so the bend in the back came out, but it is color breaking. And it got a 9.8. It's flat as hell. There are There is one bend that didn't really come out, but it's basically flat. And then there's two color breaks. Still there. I, when I saw this got a 9.8, I couldn't believe it. So, it's right... I'm sure I can't get this on screen. There. I'm going to take a picture and put it up. Like, I want to know how this hit a 9.8. I really don't get it. So I have that in a 9.8 now and never expected. And that was the issue I read five times. Like, I fucking read it. Not that I'm going to read it savagely and mess it all up, but I don't know how that hit 9.8. All right, next one up. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers number 50, I believe. The Chris Clark. Is this Chris Clark? Yeah. Uh, this is an amazing cover, and it got a 9.8. Did not press and clean this. I figured this was a 9.8. This will be for sale, pretty sure. You know, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. And another one. This is the Scorpion Comics Edition. Oh, good. I, um, what's his name? I don't remember off the top of my head. Does it say? No, it doesn't. 9.8. Didn't get it pressed and cleaned. I'm going to remember at some point during this video, and I'll just say it. And move on. Like like I knew the whole time. Here is Spider-Man 2099. This one I was planning on selling. It, I figured this one was a 9.8. I did not get it pressed and cleaned. It looked fantastic. It has like a sheen to it. I don't know. It just looks really good. I figured it was a high grade. 9.8. Awesome. Probably selling that. Most likely for sale very soon, along with many of other books. Something is Killing the Children, number one. I want to say this is the third print. Fourth print. Because I have, like, all the printings I don't even know anymore. Uh, a lot of people love this cover. I think it's all right. Didn't get it pressed and cleaned. Bought it off the shelf. Knew it was high grade. 9.8. Awesome. That one will be for sale. 100%. And another one, Something is Killing the Children, number two. Uh, I bought this off the shelf, read it, this exact copy, and uh, I did not get it pressed and cleaned. It looked really good. 9.8. That one will also be for sale. Man, this is never ending. How do people do this so fast? I feel like this is going on forever. Uh... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mighty Morphin, Power Rangers. I said that backwards. Why did I do that? But uh, this cover is sick. It's the new like character, Shredder, with as the Green Ranger, with the Green Ranger helmet. I did not get this pressed and cleaned. 9.8. I knew it. Uh, I was kind of planning on selling this one, but... I love that cover so much, and I fucking love that story what a fun collab story another one something is killing the children the peach momoko number 12 i figured this was high grade it did not get it pressed and cleaned 9.8 when i say i figured it was high grade like i looked over all these and I, I suspected them to be all 9.8s, at least the ones I like haven't been very specific on. And 
Batman number 89, the first cameo of Punchline, I think. Yeah, first cameo of Punchline. Face not revealed is what it says. Looked over this, did not get it pressed and cleaned, thought it was going to be a 9.8. Boom. This one will be for sale. So that's at least a handful for sale. Right? That's pretty good. And another one. Something is killing your children. Number two, third print. That is a pretty sick cover, if I don't say so myself. Uh, yeah. This one, I did not press and clean. I figured it was a 9.8. It looks really good, and it is a 9.8. So this one will also be for sale. I would say just like hit me up, but uh, yeah, I don't know when I'm selling these, so <laughs> probably soon. Something is killing the children. Number one, third print, pretty sick cover. I think maybe even one of the better ones. I it kind of looks like the uh. Oh, oh, the octopus is in there. I didn't even notice. I did not press and clean this. Thought it was going to be a 9.8. 9.8. That one will be for sale. 100%. For sale. I hate those bags so much. The Boys, number one. Uh, I think The Boys season one is one of the best season one on TV of all time. I'm not even kidding. I watched season one two times and then read it. The whole thing. It was one of the first like big stories I ever read. It might have been the first big story. It's like 72 issues or something. So I bought the entire lot of them back when they weren't too bad. And I did not press and clean this. I looked it over and said, nope, not press and clean in it. 9.8. That's supposed to be for sale when I sent it. I don't know. Uh, another one. Something is killing the children. Number 11. Now, this is one of my favorite covers of all time, honestly. I think the uh, black and white version is better. But uh, her eyes in this, Jenny Frison, this is fucking amazing. So, uh, 9.8. I don't even think this is worth anything. I just wanted it. That's a keeper, not for sale. Another one. Something is killing the children. Number one. Bought this off the shelf at uh, a local comic book shop for $7.99. And I almost didn't buy it because it was $7.99. I was like, why? Why is it like so expensive? That's fucking dumb. I'm not spending that. And I couldn't walk out with it. Even I even told my wife, like, maybe it'll be worth something one day. But I had to have it. And I did not press and clean it. 9.8. Yep. Uh, that one was supposed to be for sale. I don't think it's going to be for sale. I don't know. Another one. Something is killing the children. Number four. Unlocked retailer incentive. I bought this off the shelf, like many of the other ones. I uh, love this cover. Yeah, this was back when I was buying like two covers of everything for some reason. But did not press and clean it. 9.8. And it looks like we've got one more. And this is Ice Cream Man. Number 21, probably my least favorite Ice Cream Man issue. One of my least favorite Ice Cream Man issues. And one of my favorite covers. So you can see it's a little wavy. When I send it in, I don't remember it being wavy like that. But you can literally see it actually right there. So uh, this was one of the outside books, I think. Maybe that caused that wave there. When I sent it, I thought it was a guaranteed 9.8. 9.6. I just sent this in to be a keeper, but I'm a little disappointed in the 9.6, but because of some things that happened in the submission, 
like that cover a something is killing the children i mean you can judge for yourself on that picture i posted maybe i'm an over grader but man when there is multiple color breaks and a bend i don't see how that could be a 9.8 personally or maybe they they don't look at the back of the books maybe it's just the front i'm pretty sure that's what they do when they grade books yeah so that's my uh my haul mostly something is killing the children a few other ones uh a lot of these are going to be for sale some of them are not i basically said but yeah i don't know when that's going to happen i'm really excited this is me excited as fuck <laughs>